Welcome everybody to Promise Pro Wrestling Battle One TV and tonight in our Christmas special you'll see a fatal four way match between Roderick Strong, Adam Cole, Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish for the right to be called the leader of the Undisputed Era and also the winner of this match will qualify for the eight man over the top rope battle royal at Journey's End pay per view. Also tonight you'll see Even versus Neville. And in your main event, you'll see Sasha Banks versus Bailey in a two out of three falls match. And here we go with this match. For the, you'll be called the leader of the Undisputed Era. Big snap suplex and a not back back of Roderick Strong early. Undisputed Era have not had a very good start. Oh, an angle slam there, right? Roderick Strong have not had a very good start to their careers here in Promise Pro Wrestling. So they thought, let's fight it out between us and the winner will be the leader of the Undisputed Era. And will go on to Journey's End pay-per-view to have a chance to be the number one contender in the eight-man over the top rope battle royal. Roderick Strong with a big back body drop there. No, nope. um, Sorry, that was Adam Cole with the big bat. Not really very strong, my mistake. Happy Fish working over the knee of Roderick Strong. As Adam Cole and Kyle O'Reilly in the ring. Remember this is elimination style. Ooh. Roderick Strong hit hard there against the steel turnbuckle. Bobby Fish at the top row, a beautiful moonsault to the outside. That was beautiful there. Bobby Fish, Kyle O'Reilly sends Adam Cole with a knee to the midsection. And Cole rolls out to the apron. And Kyle O'Reilly with the shoulder block there. What a strong grab him. Bobby Fish is heading to the turnbuckle post. Now oh, Roderick Strong to the top rope and a big flying forearm there. That took down both Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish and all four men are outside. And a dragon screw leg whip there by Kyle O'Reilly. Roddy with a deadlift. Deadlift. Belly to back suplex there. That was beautiful. And that beautiful head scissors there by Kyle O'Reilly. And a big knee. Everybody. Kyle O'Reilly have a kick. Could be looking for a power bomb here. And a power bomb right over the guardrail. That's gonna that's gonna hurt and poor Roderick Strong's in trouble here. Kyle O'Reilly sends him straight back into the ring. Bobby Fish working over. And go and grabs his head into the local post. Roddy sends. Kyle O'Reilly into the ropes and a big job there by Roderick Strong. Adam Cole. I thought he was going for the tree over there, just rammed him into the, the turnbuckle pads and Roderick Strong sends him flying over the top rope. And there's Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish re in the ring to face off against a, a beautiful gut wrench power bomb there by. Roderick Strong. Kyle O'Reilly has them all. Over his shoulder. Oh. And into the bat breaker there. Floated over DDT by Adam Cole. Now working over the arm. Poppy Fish sends Adam Cole back into the ring. Go now. Things fish into the corner. Beautiful submission, surfboard submission hold on the outside. What the hell is this? Top rope pedigree. Top rope pedigree there by Adam Cole. Why is he not going for the cover there? Looks like he's going for a stump puller. A stump puller. And Bobby Fish. Bobby Fish tap here. No reverses it. 
just breaks our hold. No sense. Adam Cole into the turnbuckle. And again into the, the post and explode her into the corner. We fish to the second rope. And that rope drops to the top of the head. Roderick Strong sends Kyle O'Reilly into the ring. Roderick Strong now to the second row. A big elbow draw. Don't know where he was attempts at a pinfall. And a high knee lift a gut wrench. And it's a gut wrench power bomb again. By Roderick Strong. No one meant that by the my product's from Carl Riley. In trouble here, we might see some double team here, but no. And an arm breaker. Desperation move by Carl Riley. I think he was expecting to get double team and body sends him into the corner. A big boot to the head. My product's from sent to the outside again. As Adam Cole and Bob, Bobby Fish, Batman Elta still in the ring. What was he here? Twisting. Fucking arrow. Big fucking arrow there. By Bobby Fish, we see a cover here. Adam Cole's in trouble. One, two, three. And Adam Cole's the first man eliminated. Did not see that coming. Most people picked Adam Cole to win this match. Bobby Fish eliminates him. Hello, Riley. Oh, you're supposed to see something big there. A big man, a spanky. I can't get hard. It's covering Roderick Strong. One, two, three. And Roderick Strong still amazes. Not this loose. Hello, Riley. Boy, this is an exploder. Look guys working over the knee here. Oh, beautiful. We might have been going for some type of knee bar there. But now just snap that knee back. You're fishing complete control here. The Colorado fights back. Kicks in the mix section. Butterfly suplex. Butterfly suplex. Oh, beautiful. Double on DDT. Kyle O'Reilly's feeling it now. Bobby Fish falls to the outside. I think Bobby Fish has a lot of confidence in the move. Oh, what's back first into the guardrail. After eliminating both Roderick Strong and Adam Cole. Kyle O'Reilly has kicks to the back. Oh, my Bobby Fish floats over. And a bear fall. Oh, come around the dead by Bobby Fish. I think he'll try and throw Kyle Riley straight back in the ring. Yep. What oh, was he here? And a kick straight to the gut. And it makes a few And a kick to the back. And Kyle Riley's trying to figure out... Trying to figure out the ways to stop the momentum. Bobby Fish and Bobby Fish is... I thought he was trying to put him away there, but that's just another kick to the mid section. Pegs him back to one, pings him to one knee now. That's a high knee, straight to the head. Is he looking for a knockout here? Nope, now working with the arm. Just that arm back, working on the shoulder. Fish now, bringing him into the center of the ring. Again, he's going for that submission. He's going to work twist up, twist down on the arm. We're looking for an arm submission here. No, oh, he's into the final carry. So he's the first one to stun gun now. Cut around. He's in serious trouble here, Bobby Fish is feeling it. And Bobby Fish might be looking for that fucking arrow again. 
No, he hasn't got to the second row. Waiting for Kyle O'Reilly to get to his feet. You see a big move here. Double axe handle. Double axe handle to the top of the head. Big elbow drop. Now just the neck. Neck cranking out. So cranking that neck. Put pressure on the jaw as well. Just 10 minutes gone in this 30 minute time limit. There's plenty of time for Bobby Fish to put Kyle O'Reilly away, but I think he'll be thinking. I've already eliminated two. Let's get the third and get this done quickly. Top row. Super Plax. Beautiful Super Plax there. By Bobby Fish. Kyle O'Reilly's in serious, serious trouble here. That's the elbow. Again, he hit. Hit the back of Kyle O'Reilly, but still hurt his arm. That kick missed. Right, he sends by vicious Rosewood cut call with a high knee and a big club in below. Brainbuster! Brainbuster! The momentum of this match just turned a heartbeat down. No, oh, knees to the back. Kyle O'Reilly is mostly thinking guillotine here. Oh, the knee, the knees are small of the back. Yes, Kyle O'Reilly is waiting for him to get to his feet. Oh, we could see something big here. There it is, beautiful armbar. Armbar, beautiful, beautiful armbar. Beautiful, beautiful armbar. Bobby Fish is in trouble. Oh, Bobby Fish breaks it! Kai, Bobby Fish broke it! Do not give up on the Larrys! A close line, cover! One, two, three! I need you for the guy to ride! He escaped! I didn't tap with the armbar! I got caught with a close line out of nowhere! It's a beautiful backbreaker by Roderick Strong! Here we see Falcon Arrow. And that was enough to put away. I don't call this spin kick. Here we go again. A brain buster there. Call it right, Lariat. And here's your winner, and now the leader of the undisputed era, Kyle O'Reilly. And he will go forward now to Journey's End pay per view with a chance to become the number one contender. And here's your second match this evening, and it will be the debuting Rey Mysterio Jr. teaming with Dragon Lee versus the debuting team of Mysterio and Andre Ciela Marmus. This will be a dream tag team match, really. be very interesting to see how both teams coexist. coexist. I'm very much looking forward to Almas versus Rey Mysterio. Um, I'm sure people might know if these two have faced off with each other before. But to my knowledge, I don't think they have. Here we go. Almas Rey Jr. Almas sent straight over the top of it by, by Rey Mysterio Jr. Rey Mysterio. Giving up a bit of height and strength in this match. I've not experienced. Where well, Mysterio Jr. has got so much experience. Correct me if I'm wrong, I think he had to start wrestling at the age of 14. And a big belly to belly suplex there by Ray Mysterio Jr. A big elbows there. And Dragon Lee was granted this match uh, for coming in last minute as the partner to Grand Metal League after Eddie Guerrero attacked Kalisto. Unfortunately, unfortunately for Dragon Lee, he's lost his, what would have been his debut against Eddie Guerrero because Guerrero has been suspended for 30 days. So we've given this tag match as well again. Try and showcase what he can do 
It's a big kick there by almost on Ray Studio Junior. And oh beautiful fall out fall away DDT there by almost almost down with the headsets on Mysterio. Mysterio quickly gets on that and sends almost and Mysterio sends almost to the corner. And here comes Dragon Lee. No, what am I saying, Dragon Lee? There. And Ray sends him. Oh, through, through the ropes there and hit the turnbuckle hard. A beautiful set out power bomb there from Ray Mysterio Jr. And Mysterio taking Dragon Lee, and here comes Mysterio. This is this should be quick, quickly pacing a clothesline, a flying forearm there. Mysterio and another clothesline. Mysterio we've got Mr. Perfect style next now. Dragon Lee's in trouble. And he's working on the knee, or oh, pulling a knee and the hamstrings there. A crucifix, one. I've seen a lot of people in Promise of Wrestling use the crucifix bomb be held onto it there for just an old school style crucifix. Stevie on to the top wall. He's waiting for Dragon Lee to get to his feet. See something big here, but a missile drop gets to the back. Not Lou Fest press that by Dragon Lee. I was going to say Mysterio has looked fantastic so far to all this match. Dragon Lee just tags out. So here comes my Mysterio Jr. These two guys have faced each other before. I believe they wrestled each other in AAA down in Mexico. That's a beautiful suplex there, Ray Mysterio Jr. That was supposed to be a double out. Well, more like a double knee to the stomach there. We're still right now with a scoop and a Mr. Good Driver. Five was carrying the oh, oh him straight out of his knee. A gut buster there. Now it's a camel clutch. Mysterion's in the ropes. Ray Mysterio missed that double axe. Mysterio runs. Mysterio moves. Runs straight back into the ropes. Mysterio dragging Ray Mysterio to his corner. That beautiful snap me there. It was a kick to the spine. Mysterio now hiding behind Ray Jr. Oh, that's a mistake. Ray with knee and a couple of kicks to the midsection. And showing off in the corner there. Looks like he's waiting for Mysterio to get to his feet. And a big clubbing blow there. Well, Mysterio fires back. Oh, it's quick suplex there. Again, drags him over to his corner. And tags in Almond. Almost now to the top rope. What we see here by Almas. He's waiting for Ray to get to his feet. Oh, he missed that chop, he fell forward. Um, and almost missed that massive chop to the top of the head. And he's whipped into the corner. by we missed the region, and he goes, so some tag team news. Could be a rocket launcher here, a beautiful rocket launcher. All out the Midnight Express. And that Ted DiBiase style first drop there by Dragon Lee. And those stiff elbows. There we go, big DDT. And that was busted open. That DDT busted him open. The elbows, they'll be just the shoulder and neck of all us. And again, there's that. Ted DiBiase style fist to the top of the head. 
It almost always gets the hitters. He's bleeding from the forehead. He sends Dragon Lee to the corner. Here comes some tag team over here. Oh, that big hit to the head there. Uh, beautiful save. Beautiful, beautiful moves out there. And here's the cover. One, two, no, just the one count there. And Gomez is feeling it on the outside. He's holding on to the ropes just to be able to stand. He's losing blood quite quickly now. Oh, a beautiful, beautiful move there. I don't even know what to call that. It's a version of an Olympic slam. But Spanish fly. Standing Spanish fly. I'll say it again, Mysterio has looked absolutely fantastic in this match. And Northern Light Suplex. Dragon Lee unfortunately was too close to the ropes. Simon trying to get his breath back. Needs to drag Dragon Lee out of the corner. Just as I say that he does it. That's that Mr. Perfect next snap. Dragon Lee's in trouble. Tyson's just cracking on the leg forward and cracks it back. Brings him to one knee and there's that flash DDT. And a kick straight to the head. And a basement rocket to the head there. Stereo. Now. We will see. We can go for something big here. He stands on the top rope, cheering. It's not the time to do this. Dragon Lee trying to get back to his feet. What did I say? A beautiful leg kick there by Dragon Lee. A European style uppercut. And a beautiful, beautiful suplex there by Dragon Lee. Now he's waiting for Stereon to get to his feet. We see something big here. We do farmers carry into the driver. And I think now we hit his dragon we still going a bit more into the center of the ring. Almost trying to make a save. And just about makes it there. Just about there's another like suplex out of Junior. Jaw back over my Mysterio. So we approach the 10 minute mark in this match. Oh, it looked like he was going for something big, but what Mysterio cut that off and both men are down in the ring. Mysterio went back to his feet first. I think he sees Dragon Lee in trouble here. Beautiful backbreaker. Beautiful tiger backbreaker there. Mysterio waits for him to get to his feet. With a satellite tester since the hour bar. Fujin hour bar. Fujin hour bar. He's in serious trouble. Well, he doesn't tap. Again, I expected him to tap there. Still we on to the second row. What we see here? A beautiful, beautiful Hurricane that was a finger beauty. Tucks him into the center of the ring. Almost his bleeding buckets over there. Stereon sends him into the corner. Here we go. And spring. Oh, come on. Beautiful. He tries to make the attack there, but just couldn't make it. Oh, he's out. And straight into the ring. Stereon needs to put Dragon Lee away now. Into the world. I don't think Almost really wants to win this match, but he's in. He's in tag team with Louis here. You will drop it into the flat line of that. Or down with spiral, depends what you want to call it, really. Almost down. Bring Dragon Lee to his feet. Dragon Lee will find his carry takeover. Scoop. I don't miss a local driver. I think Mysterio made a mistake there. I've taken 
I was then I was in serious trouble. Nichols Ray Jr. Ray Jr. now with a rocket launcher. Almost is bleeding everywhere now. Ray Jr. now with knee to the back. Vince is celebrating. Power down, knee there. Jobs movies like that has a be beautiful move there by Ray Mysterio Jr. To the top of it, then those double elbows and things on top of it. Oh, this is now a crimson mask. I don't fancy his chances of winning this match, but Mysterio now gets his feet standing with vertical suplex. With a massive DDT. Here's a couple. One, two, and Mysterio makes the save there just in time. But he's called the Good Buster. Ray Jr. is feeling it now in the corner. And he's waiting. He's focused on the wrong guy there. He's taken out, taken out Mysterio, but he should have been trying to pull away Mysterio. He should have been trying to pull away all of us. He's just got rammed into his snake eyes into the corner. He's in his corner. Beautiful leg drop there. Did I ever talk to him? That massive, massive leg drop. Almost from the top of people struggling Lee. But they were close line. Got full on there. Fix that close line. Northern like suplex. They almost. They do a beautiful, beautiful move somewhere. That was beautiful cover. One, two, three. And he's won it. That's surprising. This is the 15 minute mark. Out of absolutely nowhere. See this big move, big DDT. That's by Dragon Lee. Beautiful moves out there. The Mama Styrion. Here we see sort of a version of an angry slam, really. So you sit out in the mission open driver. Big DDT by Ray Jr. But here's your winners. Andre Cien, the Armas, and Mysterio. Well, it was a fantastic match, ladies and gentlemen. Fantastic debut for those two men. Will we see these two team again? And maybe they could win at the Tag Team Championships. You'll only find out in the upcoming weeks. What a fantastic, fantastic debut by the two men right there. And here is your third match this evening. On the Battle of the Brits as Neville goes one on one with Even. Again, the winner of this match will qualify for the eight man over the top rope battle royal at Journey's End. The experienced advantage in this match easily goes to Neville. Look to Neville to use a hard hitting, high flying style. The same could be said about the youngster Even as, even as well. We know he's been trained by the likes of Kato Kobashi. But what can he do against Neville? As you see, he's changed the gear again. Neville straight away. There's the move that a brain buster. That's a brain buster, really. And there's the cover. What? Just the one count. Neville showing no respect for the youngster he's the, he hits the youngster with four and a four back by the youngster and a face crusher there it's an ace crusher really and a kick to the rib by the youngster and a leg kick there now what's in the middle of a crescent kick 
Oh no, a beautiful Nova Light Suplex. A beautiful Frankenstein that by Neville. And I chopped to the chest. Oh, Neville so far this match in European uppercut. Another European uppercut. Rocks the youngster. And another Nova Light Suplex. Neville out over the top row. Big Fox slices the back. A stiff kiss the back. Neville is complete control of this match. And now it's his Dragon Sleeper. Oh, the Nymphs to fire back with two. Stiff knees to the head. He needs to fire back now. Against Neville, but no. He cannot get started in this match. Oh, block that. Block that. And kick and nose to the head. Big, big kick to the back of the head. And now rolling the elbow there. Here we go with the heel. Vision of a figure four. Crank it on the leg. Oh, he goes to kick, but now we'll catch it in the dragon screw leg. Right? Beautiful dragon screw leg. Right? And the hooks is reaching for the ropes. Now we'll have big, big shots there. Now German suplex. Oh, right on the back of his head. Right, cover. One. And just the one count. I don't think Neville really think he's pulled him away that quickly. But you never know. Big my hand again. Half dancing. Dragon suplex. He jumps a bit. Oh, it just swoops the leg. That's snap me. We're authority that time. And into the head scissors. See, he's got the head scissors on there. Now we'll put it. Maybe trying to regain a bit of energy. Rolls him over again into those head scissors. It's a beautiful, beautiful submission hold by the youngster. He's rolling over again. But never, never flew back with his kick to the punches of the ribs and the kidneys there. Never know this at all. Oh, big bad body drop there by, by even, even over the rope. Done a big splash. No, tiger driver, tiger driver. You know, so even. Big step to his feet. Fireman's carry. Stun gun. That can't be it. Neville one, two, and a kick out there by Neville. I don't really think he even really thought he was going to put away Neville there. Maybe just check him where he is in this match. Fold over. Beautiful falcon arrow. That's a beautiful falcon arrow there by Ethan. Bring Neville to his feet, oh, jaw breaker that by Neville. Picks him up, can't reverse him, even jumps over. Hammer lock. Oh, beautiful pump out suplex there. Oh, twist and splash there. Bring Neville for he'd have a lot easier match. Kawada kicks. Big Kawada kicks there. Bring them with his feet, fire with carry again. So he could be going for that stun gun again. Stun gun. Could we see that move for a third time? Lariat! He hit that lariat! That's a lariat! Massive lariat by even one, two, three, he's got him! Even one over the lariat! That was very Allah Stan Hansen. That was a massive lariat. See, Brain Buster. That was the first move of the match. Neville hit the youngster with a Brain Buster and goes to the cover. He never thought he might have had it there early. 
Hey, we see that stun gun. Larry has my leave one. Oh no. This is it. We'll see it again. Larry has the massive Larry. I need a winner. I need advancing to the eight man. Over the top. Top row by the wall. At just this end. It's even. And it's main event here. In Promise Pro Wrestling. And as you have a two out of three for a match between Bailey and Sasha Banks. Again in this match the winner will go forward to journeys and pay per view and competes in the eight woman over the top row battle royal for the number one contendership. This is a storied history between Sasha Banks and Bailey. They have competed as a tag team here in Promise for Wrestling before for now, but now they want to prove who is the best wrestler between them and the best way to decide that is a two out of three more fourth match. Here we go, Sasha Banks and Bailey. Sasha with a big snap snoop blocks off the back. Look for Sasha and Bailey to try and get a pin for early here. And a big right hand there by Bailey. Oh, block that by Sasha Banks and a kick to the mix section. Oh, the beautiful Russian light sweep there by Sasha Banks. And a stiff kick to the chest and the neck area by Bailey. And a clubbing blow there by Sasha Banks. Bailey turns back to the on Lufa's press. And she's ramming her head into the, the ball back. But well, Sasha shoves her off. Banks off the ropes. A beautiful, beautiful clothesline there by Sasha Banks. Just missed that shot, Bailey rolled all the way. Oh, drops her hair back, up straight back into the apron. Into the green canvas there, and a kick to the mix action, and I'll stop it on the arm. Bailey sent hard into the turnbuckle there. Placed onto the top rope. Who is he here by Sasha Banks? So beautiful belly to back suplex. Belly to back suplex. Dangerous. Straight from the top rope. Belly here hard down. That's a kick to the. It's a stomp to the face by Sasha Banks. Sasha onto the second rope. A body splash to the back. And rounds Bailey. Bailey again. Face first into the canvas. Right in the centre of the ring. I must carry. Could we see a stun gun here? Oh. Throw first and Bailey's in trouble here. Oh, an elbow to the knee. A run stopped, kicks. Bailey again rolls, rolls away. So let's get my feeling like Jawbreaker. Who's this? Suplex. Bailey, who, what was that? Who was that coming out? I expected better from these two women. Drop it to the knee. And beautiful hand and step breaker. Bailey is completely can take control of this match for that distraction. Suplex, beautiful suplex that by Bailey. And an elbow to the back. I'm not saying that Bailey knew that was going to, someone was going to come on and try and help her. And again of an outbreaker. But Bailey just attacked. And Bailey now waiting for Sasha Banks to get to her feet. She's like, hug me. Fire his cat. Neck snap her. Or snap me, sorry. No, we on the jaw. He expected better from Bailey. What should I be good for? The belly, the Bailey to belly suplex. 
So that's just sends it into the ropes. Place her again on the top rope again. What we see here this time by Sasha. Two beautiful top rope for Corona. That was beautiful that was Sasha Banks. Cover. Referee kind of out of position. One, two. Oh, I've just kicked out there by Bailey. And then needs the back. Have a look. As you can move that arm across. Both shoulders are actually down here. The referee could actually count. Oh, it stomps on the arm. Brings Bailey to her feet, but Bailey with my knee left there. Double axe. Double axe handle. Shoulder block. Here we go. Ooh. Okay, we're in the corner. Bailey now. Send Sasha into the corner. Oh, see the hip of Bailey. So much in the corner. Oh. Sasha hit hard. Sasha hit hard. No, Sasha reverses it. Oh, close line. Every time Bailey gets a little bone red, Sasha can fire back as quick as she can. All the run. Never go. Cover up, cover up. One, two, three. And Sasha Banks is one, one nil up. And this match carries on straight away. No rest period here. The promise for wrestling. Bailey now. Beautiful, beautiful butterfly suplex there by Bailey. Bailey now to the top row. We will see that Randy Savage style elbow drop from Bailey. Big elbow drop. Big elbow drop cover. One, two. Oh, Sasha Banks kicks out. She kicks out a massive Randy Savage elbow from the top rope. Bailey's got to be thinking belly to belly. She's been getting Sasha to her feet. Beautiful, but who's this now? It's Nia Jax. What is Nia Jax doing here? Let's see. Crucifix! One, two. Well, what's Nia Jax doing here? Both women look at each other and go, What are these, both of these people doing here? Why is Nia Jax in the corner? What business does Nia Jax have? In this match, this match does not involve her. It does not involve anybody she teams with. She, she's just out there, and a bubble dog there by Sasha Banks. She seems to be cheering Sasha Banks on. One, two, and a kick out there by Bailey. Could we see an alliance here between Sasha Banks and Nia Jax? Is that what we're seeing here? So, oh, what's that on the hamstrings? Poor bird, we see the surfboard there. Sasha Banks starts the second row. If Baines gets to her feet. A beautiful, beautiful draw kick there by Sasha Banks. And she's onto the second turn buckle. She's feeling it now. She's got the 1 0 lead. Bailey flat on her back in the center room and what seems to be her new new bodyguard or new partner on the outside chain of one. I was saying how Bailey Bailey could be the one here playing mind games with the music hitting, but was that a master stroke by Sasha Banks? To begin with the main Bailey falling the force of security. And 
When she needs it, my just comes roaring out. Train forward, throw aside. Bailey's listen to her, I think that's a one, two, and a kick out there by Bailey. Quick kick out there by Bailey. And Nijax can't believe it, there's a knee to the back. Sasha Banks now, looking for that netbreaker again. Netbreaker. Cool, what's it? Two, three, and she's beat Bailey. Two falls for one. Two falls to zero, I apologise. That was... That was embarrassing for Bailey. You see that hangman step the net breaker. Bailey with a big elbow off the top of Give Sasha credit for getting out of that. It's in that net breaker again. Oh. Yes! This is an example for Nia Jax and Bailey. Nia Jax and Sasha Banks are now a force here in post pro wrestling. What does this mean for the rest of the women in post pro wrestling? And this means Sasha Banks is now qualified for Journey's End pay per view. But we'll see you there in six days' time. Thank you for watching, everybody, and good night.